Vice President Kashim Shetima has attributed his current position to the values instilled in him during his formative years as a student. Shetima spoke at the 24th Combined Convocation Ceremony of the University of Meduguri. The Vice President, who acknowledged the role of teachers and mentors in shaping his path, recalled their patience while imparting a great deal of knowledge to him. He said it was a privilege to uphold the institution's values, part of the reason he was deeply moved to accept the honorary degree. The vice president said the gathering symbolized collective aspirations as an institution. On the security challenges faced by Medugri, he said even though the city was renowned for its fidelity to education, it had come under attacks and threats. Shetima, however, noted that in the face of the challenges, the Borneo State Capital remained resilient. While accepting the honorary doctorate degree, Shetima said he considered it an invitation to greater responsibility. He pledged to stay on the track that favored humanity, drawing inspiration from the invaluable lessons learned in the University of Meduguri. Nigerian universities can empower their students with the necessary skills and competences that will make them a positive force for societal growth and development. While the same topic, Nigerian researchers can deploy their considerable technical know-how and creative abilities to provide innovative solutions to everyday challenges that stand as impediments to what should otherwise be productive efforts of citizens, especially those in the grassroots. Undoubtedly, Nigerian universities have been thrust at the center of leadership within the higher education sector. In this way, it behoves on them to exhibit certain leadership traits within the communities they serve as bastions of the highest academic traditions. Nigerian universities must educate a strong sense of discipline among their ranks. With members who are well educated, they must be able to view problems from a wide range of perspectives while being incisive in their analysis of issues. Earlier, the Vice Chancellor of the University, Professor Aliyu Shugaba, who thanked the Vice President for gracing the occasion, acknowledged that Shetima had given much to the school. Professor Shugaba, who decried the current challenges bedeviling the university, appealed for more support for tertiary institutions across the country. The university will continue to provide learning opportunities for the youth of the nation. I dare say, at this point, that the university of Medjugorje has assumed a leading position in the number of student population. Having a student population of nearly 75,000. 